what we know is that tackling climate change and environmental degradation is fundamental to tackling extreme poverty. Um, and for emerging economies also, climate action will also mean investing in resilient green growth, because any solution to climate change that doesn't allow economic growth in developing countries would clearly not be acceptable. So achieving food security is one of the key challenges developing countries face. And the global goal of zero hunger will only be a reality if food systems can adapt effectively to climate change. Climate science for adaptation is not just about hypotheses of real of what futures might look like, but it's about how do we inform real action now to improve lives today and tomorrow. Uh, when thinking about our possible futures for climate change risks, we've learned a lot. We still have a long way to go. Um, and we're going to need to understand how climate change development pathways and adaptation and mitigation responses will interact together to determine the risks we face and the most effective solutions. But often the solutions are local solutions and what works in one location may not be the optimum in another. We have to understand how to take that local learning and transfer it appropriately. We also really need to, to understand how to make the local and global transitions, just transitions. <laughs>